Now, the Fox 61 Weather Watch with Chief Meteorologist Rachel Frank. A warm, wet, and humid night ahead. Temperatures right now are in the upper 60s to right around 70 degrees. Reduced visibility right now here in the New Haven area. And taking a look, we had one batch of showers come through a little while ago, then a break, and now here is round number two. Mostly just seeing some rain. It looks like the rumbles of thunder from here on out have pretty much fizzled, although maybe you have a chance to see one in far southeastern Connecticut. The heaviest rain in the state right now is here from Wolcott up through Plymouth and Bristol. That will continue to pivot north towards Canton. If you're in Harwinton, it's just knocking on your doorstep and Torrington as well. If you're in the eastern half of the state, most of what pushes on through will be much lighter in intensity, although you can see some thunderstorms here to the east. It looks like most of that is going to end up missing us. So a wet night. We have more chances for rain in the days ahead, including Wednesday and on Friday. Scattered showers and storms both of those days and maybe a stronger storm during the day on Wednesday and no summer heat in store. Once again, we're talking about temperatures that will be near or even below average as we head through the week ahead. Low temperatures tonight will be back down around 60, so not dropping off all that much as we head towards daybreak tomorrow and areas of patchy fog out there as well, especially for anybody that might be a third shifter. Heading into the day tomorrow, we start the day off with humidity, but we finish with more of a refreshing air mass building in. We'll see high temperatures between 75 to right around 80 degrees. We're gonna start the day off though with a lot of clouds and we'll see more sunshine developing as we head through the afternoon. So here are those clouds to start off the day. This is 6 a.m. It may require some patience for us to get there, but I do think we will. Here we are by you know, 3, 4 o'clock and much of the state is seeing that sun. Heading into your Wednesday, I think the humidity starts to build back in again. We're going to start the day off with partly cloudy skies and we'll see a rising chance for showers and thunderstorms as we head through the afternoon. This computer model is showing a chance for some stronger storms. So if you do have outdoor plans on Wednesday, just keep an eye on the forecast and we'll keep you posted to see if this timing ends up changing. There is a chance that the ingredients may come together a little bit later on Wednesday, which would help reduce any impact from stronger storms, but we're still unsure at time this is really going to come together. So we're going to watch for the chance for scattered showers and storms in the afternoon, and some of that may continue into the evening. We are briefly dry for Thursday. And then we have that next chance on Friday. Here's a look at Wednesday's high temperatures climbing into the lower to middle 70s. So it's on one day, off another, on one day, off another. I'm cautiously optimistic about the weekend. I think most of the time will be dry on Saturday, maybe an isolated shower. And it's looking good for Dad's Day on Sunday with highs in the mid to upper 70s. Here's a quick look at your shoreline seven day forecast. Again, temperatures near or below average across the board. Ben.